All right, y'all, we're back out here. Another round. <laughs> we got Santa in the building, Santa. Yo, we've gotten so many iguanas out of here, man. Oh, wait. Oh, he's upside down. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, is he all right? Hey, man. Bro, what? Oh. What's going on with them? Bro. Completely upside down. He probably whacked his head, man. He's going to have a headache. Completely upside down. Sheesh. There's a baby right there, too, man. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, whoa. This one's full of life. Yo, that's crazy. <laughs> one is like half dead and one is doing the wiggles. <laughs> oh, man. Insane, insane. All right, let's bag these two, right. man. Let's bag them. Let's get them. some more. Frozen iguanas, baby. Boy, as we back out here in a forest, man. Looking for some frozen ones, Ooh. bro. Insane, man. Oh, right there. that one right there, man. Oh, holy smokes. Looking back around. Oh. Yo, another one, another one back there, dude. Yo. Look at that, man. Look, we're just gonna just keep piling these things up, right? Bring them over here and put them in a pile. Count them out, yep. Keep them right there. Got the truck light. Hopefully that doesn't warm them up. Yeah, dude, there's a bunch of them out here, man. This place is infested. Look, another little guy. Frozen solid. Yep. All right, man. Ooh, got two right here, boy. Two green ones. Dang, son. These trees out here are loaded with these invasive green iguanas. Literally hundreds of them right in this area. I can almost guarantee you there's gonna be a lot more to be found. Yo, whatever we catch, bro, just put them right here in front of this tree, all right? Okay. This way we can get a nice count and uh, we can show you guys exactly what we're talking about. <laughs> oh, that was really good, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, we have a bunch of them right here. Oh, a whole bunch of iguanas. Right here at the base of this tree. Oh. Wow. And they're all frozen. Oh. M. G. Another one right here too. Yo, they're it's even inside the holes. Oh, man. Dude. One right here. Jeez. Those silly guys. At least seven iguanas all underneath this tree, man. I'm telling you right now, guys is the coldest week we've had in florida in decades y'all temperatures are in the 40s almost in the 30s the high 30s this is insane let's go ahead clean up florida's ecosystem one frozen iguana at a time wow dude his tongue is yeah. jacked up it's out of his mouth and it looks frozen look at this are you all right dude his tongue is red Oh man, I don't know if he's alive or not. This guy's definitely not alive. Look at him. Right here, right here, up here, up here. See how he's. This guy is definitely out there as you see this. Man. And you guys want to hear something crazy, right? Some of these iguanas will come back to life and some of them will not. It's about 80% uh, of them, dude, will, can survive and come back and then 20% just die off rip. Wow. That's insane, bro. Let's go keep looking for more, man. I'm telling you, out here, there are hundreds of them. We've got a small one right in front of you. Right here. Oh, yeah. Yep. Little guy. You want to add him to the pot real quick before you, sure. we venture out? Dude, insane, bro. That's crazy. Insane. I'm telling you, bro, this area is loaded. By these trees, they probably climbed up once it got cold. Yeah, in this area too, they don't they don't really burrow too much. It's like they, they all mostly live in trees. Yep. Yep, more. As expected, the base of the tree. Ooh, that one's up, dude. Yeah. Watch out right for in. that. That guy looks like he's toast. He's like frostbitten right there. Let me see where. What's wrong with his mouth? Jeez. Oh. He's like going in slow motion. He's like. 
trying to whip he's his he's swimming. Hands. It's like he's in a bad dream. <laughs> nah, oh. dude, he's trying to fight. Oh, oh, oh smoke, look at his eye. What? Or his mouth. On earth. Bro, that is wicked, man. That is. That is wicked. All right, I'm going to go ahead and bag and tag. We're in a good spot right now. Yeah, let's not waste too much time. It's really getting cold. And i seen in about 30 minutes, we're going to have a little bit of rain. So that's why it's picking up with that wind. Hurry up, man. Come on. All right, let's go, let's go quick. Yep. Hooper. Let's go quick. Try to bag and tag into the water. Yep. Where do you see? Inside the tree. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Whoa. Yo. Oh. Another one, too. He tried making it in there. Oh, man. This one didn't make it. Two for one right there. Nice, bro. Add him to the pile. Yo. This is like a, a frozen iguana scavenger hunt. Look, we got some more right here. Whoa. Three of them. Three of them. Man. It's like they got knocked out the tree and they tried getting up. I'm trying to climb back up the tree. Silly, silly iguana. Should have never went in that tree in the first place, buddy. <laughs> Pause right here, bud. Damn, this pile's getting thick real quick. Yeah, well, believe it or not, man, like I said, there's hundreds of iguanas in here. This looks like about, can we get a count real quick so we can kind of know where we're at in the, yeah. in the removal? All right, let's go. One, two, mm -hmm. three, yep. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Sixteen already. Sixteen already. Yep. Nice. Nice. Grab that boy. Keep them all right here. We're gonna load them up, all boys. Right, cool. Give you guys, give you guys what we're seeing out here. This is a forest that we're in. Yeah. Sometimes they can be in the trees too. Let's keep looking right here. And they really like these, these cypresses. They'll go really high mm -hmm. and they'll stay on those thick trees. But the issue over here, man, is like there's a lot of wind. Oh. Another one over here. Another yep. two for one special right here. Oh, yeah. Those guys look like they're dead, bro. These? Yeah, they yeah. look knocked out. Like, you, like, what I'm realizing, dude, is like sometimes when they fall from these really tall trees and they just hit the ground, it's like sometimes they can get an injury on their head. Like, look at his head right yeah. there. Uh -huh. See how it's like kind of sunk in it? It's really yeah. soft right there. Oh, man. It's really soft, so I think he might have got like, like uh, hurt. Oh shoot! This guy's eyes are open, so he's good. Seems like his eyes are really red, though. It's probably really cold. He looks kind of sleepy and groggy. That guy for sure, hundred percent dead, though, bro. Hundred percent. Let's keep Let's looking. Oh, wait. Green, green one. His eyes are open too. Yeah. Is that one good? Yeah, he's alive. Dude, that's insane. All right. Wanna make a mini pile here yeah, make a mini back. pile here. Yep. 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 Hooper, you see anything? No. Keep in mind, here, Hooper, you gotta look, man. You gotta look, buddy. You know what's insane, dude? The population of iguanas in Florida is like in the couple of millions. Yeah, so there's a lot of them. This is a big tree. Super big, bro. Oh, yep. There's a bunch of them right here. Oh, sh oh, shit. I almost, oh, damn. I almost oh. stepped on one. My bad. Oh. Damn, look at this right here. Oh, look at his foot. Something. Oh, what? Oh. On yeah, three in a row. Earth. Look at his foot right there. Yo. He got attacked. Hold on. Hold on one second. Yo. All right, let me zoom out of that. That was a little uh, TMI. Wow. Wow, for real. Man. Guys, there are iguanas, frozen iguanas just piled up everywhere here in Florida. You know, some people get presents under their tree for Christmas. Here in Florida, we get iguanas, guys, frozen ones. Well, I guess they're kind of like presents if you look at it like that, right? I mean, shoot, who can complain about a frozen tree chicken, tree turkey for, for Christmas? Incredible. All right, let's keep... Let's keep looking, y'all. Oh, yeah. More iguanas. Silly, silly iguanas. Sheesh. They're like poopsicles, like iguanasicles. Yo. They are literally everywhere, and they're all frozen. How many do we get from this tree, dude? I don't know. What? Like what? Like six or seven of them? At least. There's got to be more around here, dude. I knew, know that there's way more that live in this tree. 100% sure. Got to keep looking, boys. So 
so far we are cleaning up shop here guys rose and iguanas we are putting them in the bag look at that man that is a pretty sight right there a lot of people have been saying they've been waiting for the cold front man so it's kind of bluish too he probably got frozen and he turned blue look at underneath his belly it's yellow and look at his head and his neck area it's blue he good bro must be that cold that he's just turning blue man add him to the pile bro silly frozen iguana one. yep dang they are literally dropping out the trees like flies left and right Sheesh. Like flies. More here. Right here. Yep, more here. Wow. Yep, about the same size as the other one. Another Gray, one. too. Another one? Another one. Guys, this cold front in Florida is no joke. It's, These iguanas are definitely paying the price. Oh. <laughs> There's another one right here, dude. <laughs> are you serious? Jeez. They're just frozen. They're just like... like half dead oh man that one looks like he's a goner look at yeah he just looks like there's not that much left in him all right man oh uh, wait right behind you hooper hooper <laughs> oh, man. another one and oh and another one yo that's ridiculous that is ridiculous yo i've never caught iguanas like this before Whoa, it's never been this cold before, dude. <laughs> and when it does get cold, it's usually gone in like a day here in Florida. It's so bipolar. We have it for a whole week, man. So I told you, man, let's get on our jobs, dude. Let's get these iguanas back. Let's get paid, man. Add that to that pile right there. Yes, sir. Ooh. Now we got two piles. Yep, just add them right there. Yep. And it works. This one kind of looks a little lively. Yeah. Oh. oh! Oh shoot! Oh yeah! yeah. Oh. oh, he sure do got a little life to him now, boy. Watch out for that dang tree getter now. He will. Yeah, he's got a little life oh, to him. He does. Out of all of them, this guy. Think about that. Look, we have about almost close to forty iguanas here, and this is the most liveliest one we have. Insane, one out dude. Of forty. Insane, right. bro. Yeah. Yeah, dude, that's incredible, man. We got a nice little pile. Hey, put him in there real quick. Let's do some more rounds, man. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're going to get a lot more, and we're going to see how many we have at the end. So stay tuned. Like, comment, and subscribe. You ready? Yeah. Let's, let's go see if we can get some more. Is that rock right there? Yeah, see that rock? I yeah. think I see a tail coming out of it. Wait, what? Yeah. Oh, oh, look at that. Oh, oh hold, that on, hold on. Who's that peeking around the corner? It's Yo, a frozen he's hiding in the rock right now. <laughs> Yo. Oh. Are you serious? No way. Jeez. Oh, shoot. Yo. Wow. Hold on. Let me get a oh, shot of that. That is unreal, dude. Are you serious? Man, he's he's got things figured out in that little, uh, that stump he's in. Damn, he looks warm and cozy. He do, bro. <laughs> he low-key do. He looks so unbothered right now. Got old trunks and old rotting veg vegetation. It lets off heat as it decays, bro. Yeah. So it's probably like a couple degrees warmer in there. Exactly. Plus it's blocking all that wind, too. Dude, I've never seen an iguana like that before. Damn, well. Unfortunately, you are an invasive creature, and you need to be removed from the ecosystem. That's right, man. That's right. Unfortunately, guys, as sad as it sounds, it is true. Um, do a quick Google search if you don't believe me. We're not. I'm not going to sit here and explain all that stuff to you. But, uh, yeah, it, it is true, guys. These little things are uh, taking over Florida. And they're so hard to catch uh, when it's warm. You know, they're fast. They're smart. They swim. They climb. So, right now, we're definitely taking advantage of this cold snap. Uh, able to get them while they're fr in this frozen zombie state. Look at him. He's like, wow. he's like, Rare. so zombie. Like. Zombie. He's like, yeah. Man, dude, oh. great eye, bro. Great wow. eye, great wow, catch, no. man. Silly iguana. Another one right here. Another guy. Got some questions for you, bud. We got a couple questions for you. How did it feel falling from that high? Sheesh. Man. That's at least what? I don't know, a 70 foot tree? Yeah. It's up there. Yeah, yeah. Let's pile them up. Damn. Pile them up. You got a lot of ones. Oh, yeah, buddy. Tis the season for frozen iguanas. 
Let's get some more. So look, it's our second pile right here. Not too bad of a haul. Let's we'll go ahead and bring them together. Cooper, you want to grab the rest of them? Yeah, sure. We're going to bring them to the other pile. And that way we can form one big mega pile. Now keep in mind, these iguanas, they do a pretty good job of camouflage. I mean, with the trees, the branches, just the overall background of their surroundings. Right here. Oh, shoot. Perfect example. Completely blended in with the background. Wow. Camouflage. Didn't even see him there. Yeah, exactly. Did not even see him there. You really got to get a good eye for them. And you can really spot them. Oh, Add them to the pile. oh my gosh, dude. How many do we have? Do we have like a zillion of them? Oh, these trees are loaded. Loaded, 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 loaded. Insane. Let's see. But like snook and tarpon love to hang around these mangroves, so might be good, right? Yeah. Iguanas love it too. Look up, look up there. There's a bunch in that tree right there. Oh, right there. Yeah. There's like five of them right oh. there in the branches sleeping. Yeah, they're they're lucky because right now they're being blocked from that wind. You see how they're like all in that one area? Yeah. How do they know that? By using each other for body warmth too. Oh, that yeah, just radiate yeah, radiating off each other and then getting blocked from that wind. Big one right there, dude. Ooh. Big one. Ooh. Oh. Oh. My goodness. Big alpha. This might be a big boy in the area. Oh. Big boy. Big alpha. Oh. Wow. Yo. Oh, big alphas. That thing's huge. Yeah. Look at that thing. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Oh man. Yo, you know what it looks like? It looks like uh. a Pokemon, like the Steelex, buddy. You know that Pokemon? Yeah. Oh, like an Onyx, right? That's what it's called? Yeah, Onyx. It looks like an Onyx, dude. I don't know if that makes any sense. Hold on. Whoa. And he's got a jacked up jaw. Holy smokes. Oh. Sheesh. Yo, that boy's got the flu. Yo, Damn. hold on. Hold on. Open it, man. He's got like an infection or something. Oh. Oh, man. A mango in there. Oh, man. Man. Sheesh. All right, you already know the deal. Let's go ahead and bag him and tag him. Bag and tag. Yeah, look at that thing, dog. Yo, that thing looks like a straight up Onyx T Rex, like a Steel X. I can't even, words can't even describe how crazy that thing looks, man. Wow. Wow, what a dinosaur. Yo, that is not even, that's beyond a dinosaur. It's a Pokemon. <laughs> look at that thing. <laughs> Yo, oh my gosh, it's huge. His Dulap is massive. <laughs> look at his spikes. I, he has like four inch spikes. Yo, that is a stud of a dragon. Man, I can almost guarantee you he's the alpha of this area. All right, there he is right there. Big Onyx. He's definitely a Pokemon, <laughs> man. Massive, 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 massive. His Monster head looks bigger bro. than your head, bro. His yeah. Yeah, dude. Oh, he's looking right at you. He got mad when I said that. That's a straight Pokemon. Could you imagine having one of these things like live in your house, like on your in your tree or even in a big hole in your yard? Jeez, I couldn't imagine, man. A big hole, dude. You have a big giant Pokemon like this just just in there. Wow. That's got to be the biggest iguana of the day, man. One last thing to do. What are yeah. we going to do with the silly iguana? Bag him and tag him. Bag him and tag him. You're coming with us, Mr. Pokemon. In the bag. All right. That's a Damn. pile right there, boys and girls. Ooh. All right, so finally we have one big pile of the iguanas. We're gonna do a final count for you guys. See exactly how many iguanas we removed. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, <laughs> 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 3, 34, 35, 36, 37, and cannot forget about this big boy. This big boy makes 38. So, dang. That is a true beast right there. And oh. uh, 
Thirty eight iguanas removed. Yo, no complaints right there, man. Dang, son. That is a massive hole. That is gonna be a great payday. Check that out right there. You guys see it for yourselves. Thirty eight iguanas, frozen iguanas, fell out the tree. We were able to come out here to the job and get a big win for Florida, helping getting rid of these invasive species, y'all. Thirty eight silly iguanas in the bag. All right, guys. As you saw, we came to the job. We removed this big pile of iguanas. Thirty eight invasive iguanas, including this monster alpha iguana right here. So. I would say today's episode was a job well done. If you guys like the video, be sure to give a like, comment, and subscribe. And comment down below if you want us to come back and search for more of these invasive iguanas. Until then, it's your boy Roddy from Red Sport Fishing signing out. Merry Christmas and have a great day.